Thing depicting a police officer as a pig has become a political football tonight on Capitol Hill. The artwork has been up and down every few hours today. At last count, six times up and down. Missouri Democratic Congressman William Lacey Clay has returned the painting to an exhibit of constituent artwork after its removal by Republican colleagues. Clay says the issue is about the Constitution. California Congressman Dana Rohrbacher says Republicans will keep taking it down if Clay keeps putting it back up. And one of his colleagues, Congressman Duncan Hunter, says he will ask the architect of the Capitol to take the painting down permanently. It portrays uh, police officers as pigs and it doesn't belong in the U.S. Capitol. It's that simple. And, uh, and we're going to take it down. It actually violates House rules. It's about defending the Constitution. It is just pathetic that some Republican members and alt right media types who constantly refer to themselves as constitutional conservatives don't think that that same document protects the fundamental free speech rights of my 18-year-old constituents. This is an insult to all police officers everywhere who are protecting the American people, but especially it's an insult to those two police officers who gave their lives so, so members of Congress wouldn't be mowed down and shot in their own offices. Republican Congressman Barry Loudermilk of Georgia tells Fox he wants to replace the painting with a poster of the names of police officers who have been killed in the line of duty. As of right now, at this hour, the painting is back.